All right, guys, so we are here today, and we're going to be doing a Bleach Brave Souls video. Um, so essentially, I'm going to be taking on the Boss Rush event. Uh, right now, I'm just bringing my Mono Kampachi just because I'm using all the links of all my other characters in different teams. But for Boss Rush, honestly, a Mono Kampachi full DR build uh, is usually enough for this entire team. I have nothing to really worry about here. Take a look at his augments. We have a Chappie with 24% stamina. I would like to get that to attack or take that to, you know, 40% uh, stamina, which would be awesome. Uh, or 30%, I think it is, on the actual Chappies. I have an 80%. Uh, Captain's Cloak, and for Pupples, I have 40% stamina. He is really built to tank in PvP, and I'm running my PvP build on him right now. Uh, usually, that's all you need on a boss rush is a PvP Kenny for the um, strength one, and you usually have no problems. We're going to go ahead and throw all the different boost items. Actually, we don't need focus, um, because focus is there. He has no focus. So save us uh, 300 coins, and I have no friends because I've been grinding out all day. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. Uh, essentially, I'm going to do these recordings in separate times. So this is going to be the first one that I do uh, with Broken. And uh, once I'm done with him, I'm going to go and take on the agility one because I have a full technique team. And then I'll come back a little bit later and do a different team after that. Uh, but yeah, so we're going up against this right now. I don't have to really worry about taking any damage here because... Oh, look at that. He, uh, I forgot to take the auto off. <laughs> so, it's not horrible. Let's get, let's get out of here, because he's gonna do that. And, yeah, I didn't take a lot of damage, so that's freaking awesome. Boom, and boom. I think I need to have this, like, under, like, a couple of minutes or something like that. Was it two minutes? One minute and thirty seconds. So, I'm, allo I'm allotted thirty seconds per boss, which is insane. But that's not a problem. I wish I had another broken to take with me, <laughs> but uh, Yuma Chico should be fine. He's a uh, he's a stupid, and I usually just go one, two, three out him, and his uh, special doesn't really do too much damage as it is anyway. So yeah, that, I'm I'm golden there, and boom. Oh wow, I freaking got hit with a debilitator, huh? Yeah, there we go. Boom. Yeah, you done, boy. And boom. And you know what? We have time. We have some time. There we go. So we just want to get some extra health just to play it safe. And we, we're good. We only have about, we have 40 seconds left or 37 seconds left technically. And we're good. And we can go over here with Dongai Ichigo. We're going to throw on our boost. Uh, we're going to do this. Yeah, look at that boost go into action. We're freaking knocking him out. And can we get out of here before we get struck? Yeah, we got enough. We got out of there more than enough time. And there we go. Another freaking melee attack and boom, he is gone. And that, my friends, is how you take on Boss Rush with a Mono Ken DR the team. <laughs> so that's actually, you know what, one thing I will say about this. Um, if you guys play a lot of PvP, or if you're not, if you're new to this game and you, th you thought about trying it, first things first, uh, well, I'm not going to really make this a tutorial video. All I'm going to say is against Boss Rush and on, if you're using NAD character uh, for co-op, build them as if you would build them for, in PvP for damage reduction and healing and a whole bunch of tanking because it's gonna it's gonna pay off in the end because you won't ever freaking die that's exactly the biggest problem in pvp in co-op well obviously pvp but co-op and boss rush is you dying um well obviously killing the character quickly in boss rush but at the end of the day you know you, you want to make sure you survive wow this loading screen is taking forever what the hell's going on well i'm gonna go ahead and reset that this is the first time this has happened but i'm gonna go ahead and reset the screen i'll be right back all right, and we're back. Uh, so I'm over here now, and I just got the, the game actually loaded back up. We're going to go ahead and take on speed. This one's going to be a little bit more difficult uh, because I do have a Kendo Kenpachi, but I'm not bringing a full DR Kendo Kenpachi with me. I'm, I'm actually doing this. I'm bringing my Kenpachi. I gave him a lot of NAD, and uh, I think he just has NAD. That's all he has is NAD on him. Uh, then I have my Tensa Zangetsu, Tensa Zangetsu, and he has full strong attack damage. Uh, we don't want that, actually. Um, and then I have my Mayuri, who's just going to one-shot the last boss. He has full, like, one of those full stamina. Uh, he has the full stamina character link skill, so he has 48% because I haven't gotten my 5-star Byakuya up to level 100 to increase that. I'm going to do that um, at some other point once I can grind out some more characters to get him maxed out. I've been working on a couple of my other cards. Uh, essentially, I have a whole bunch of 6-stars, and 5-stars I've been 100 percenting and a lot of this, uh, some of the six stars have been really working on getting those orbs or the uh, the droplets, so that way I can get them to uh, level 200 as fast as I can. I'm only I only got two more left, two more 200 level 200 characters left. Now I should get them all set. Um, but all right, we're ready to go. We're gonna go ahead and take it on with this team. 
Uh, essentially, you want flurry characters. Flurry characters work really well in boss rush. I like them really a lot. And then you can get one boss killer, and you can just go through with one boss killer without any problem. So we'll take a look and see what ha what happens over here. Um, I think what I could do is I, if I you know go through the first round with Kampanchi, just take him out, to, uh, take out the character out. Then the second round, one shot with Mayuri, and then I could have my second character. As long as my friend character doesn't die within those first two rounds, then I can go have him distract the last character while Kampanchi takes out the other one. Uh, we'll see how it happens with the full bring Ichigo. I didn't take a look and see what he has. Rangiko usually doesn't have anything too debilitating on her, so it's usually not a problem. So let's go ahead and take her out. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, look how freaking quick she goes. That's it. Oh wow, she took out Ichigo though. Alright, so I took her out in 20 seconds. We're gonna go ahead and switch over to Zangetsu. He moves around quicker, and my Biop, well, my Kimpachi is about to die, and I might need to switch over to him to take out the rest of Mayuri. Just that Mayuri might, like, freaking go ape on me. <laughs> Boom. Alright. No, 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 no. Don't kill me. Alright, cool. He didn't kill me, but he did poison me. And that's why I'm switching over to Biakia. Just to finish him off. Wow, that was actually a lot quicker than I thought. 30 seconds. I have nothing to worry about there. And then what I'm going to do is get to the last round. And we're going to take my Mayuri. And Mayuri is going to go and one-shot Retsu. Boom, look at this, okay. Yeah, baby. Oh, look at this freaking weird-ass looking thing. <laughs> Heck yeah. One shot it, that's how you do it, that's how we do it. Alright, cool. So, um, that is for boss rush round 11, which is awesome. Mayuri is done. Cool, now I, I'm going to be doing the other uh, attributes a little bit later, mind and heart. Those are pains in the butts to do because it's so easy to die. Um, so, I'm going to be right back because I have to change up the character links on the, uh, the power. My, yeah, my power, because I have to go over the tech one next. So I'll be right back after I'm done uh, modifying the power, uh, the power team. Alright guys, so we are back. We're going to go ahead and take on the technique version of the boss rush, or the technique side of boss rush. So I'm running my, um, oh damn, I always forget his name. <laughs> He's the uh, flurry uh, captain killer, Noitura. So I have him, we have him with a chappy, a pupples, and a chappy, and he has full uh, normal attack damage on him. Uh, full attack, yeah, so that's what's going on with him. He's a pretty badass character, I like him. He's going to be doing some decent damage. I got my Barry with full Tai Shintai, and the same thing as before with the Mayuri. He has full uh, damage increase at full stamina, so we won't be using him till the end. Um, augments for my Ichigo, this is the one who has both the uh, Hollow and the Soul Reaper killer ability. He has Yuki with uh, all stats, he has a Captain Coat with all stats, and he has the book which is all stats and spiritual pressure and full spiritual pressure. So we're going to go ahead and take it on real quick, I should be able to get through this without any problem. Uh, at that point we're going to go ahead, the audio may change after this one because after this event, um, I'm going to cut it off and edit the audio, then I'm going to do the second half of it later because I don't have time to actually do the heart and the mind one right now. <laughs> so, uh, but yeah, anyway, um, we're we'll go ahead and do that right now. So let me know, if, do you guys actually, I know a lot of you told me you don't play it and you've been thinking about getting started. I, I thoroughly enjoy this game. I personally like this game more than Dokkan Battle in some cases and a hell of a lot more than, than, than Naruto Blazing Battle. Like, Dokkan is what I started, what started me on this whole thing. Um, I'm really, like, I, I enjoy it a lot. But, yep, no, Rukia, get the hell out of here. We're going to kill you. Look how quick this guy, this girl died. Man, freaking Anoiter is kicking some butt. Uh, this game's a lot of fun for me because it's so interactive. If Dokkan Battle brought a mode like this, Dokkan would be broken. <laughs> like, for real. Uh, this is what um, the, um, what do you call it, should have been. Damn, I, I killed him before he even got a super attack off. How freaking, oh my god, yes. Um, he also has advantage because I believe he's a captain killer. So that definitely helps him out a lot. And we're going to go ahead and Koga. Look at this. Yeah, Barry, you go. You go, Barry. Look at that. Oh, this is such a freaking... I remember when I first saw this when he first came out. I was like, I have to have him. I pulled him in my first multi. I was so freaking hyped. What? He didn't die? What's up with that? That's awesome, but I, I killed him before his uh, super can get me. That was freaking pretty awesome. All right, cool. Round 11, done. Uh, well, I got to go set up these characters for the next recording, but uh, I'll do this probably either later on tonight or tomorrow. But um, yeah, guys, so... I'll wrap up the video in the later section, but so by the time it's just going to take a couple seconds for you because you're going to see the next clip. But anyway, guys, yep, I'll see you in the next section. 
All right, guys. So we're back, and we're going to be doing the last two stages of Boss Rush here on Bleach Brave Souls. So let's go ahead and jump into it. We're going to go and try to get the editing brush. And actually, you know what? If I was able to get the editing brush at the end of this, we'll go ahead and see if we could spin or do a reroll on some of my items. Uh, we're actually going to switch. There we go. Okay, cool. So I'm bringing my Sajin, level 200, who has full DR uh, and uh, well, essentially normal attack increases on him. I'm uh, bringing my Ukiora, who has full strong attack build, and my um, Ayanaro, who has a full, um, what do you call it, I don't want that, <laughs> a full um, damage increase for in full stamina. So, we're going to go ahead and use them. Can I get a broken up in here or something like that? I don't know, I really can't get anything good, uh, just because I've been grinding all day and I didn't know that I was, I didn't think that I was going to go ahead and do this. You know what we can do? We're going to go ahead and bring a friend Shiro. And Shiro, ooh, Spiritual Pressure 20, all stats and stamina. Okay, that's not bad. Let's see if this friend has... Yeah, no, we're going with the first one. All right, cool. So hopefully Shiro can help me take out the first boss without too much trouble. All right, cool. Here we go. Boom. Five-star Akon. Akon and Young Jesus. All right, cool. I'm done. <laughs> and whenever I see Akon over here, I just, like, think of back in high school listening to Akon when he started getting, like, really big. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, I'm dating myself, I know. All right, cool. So, Sajin goes up again. Sajin. Yeah, I need to actually read the manga because I have no idea how he went from a dog to a uh, human. Or if he was, like, a dog before. Whoa, damn. All right, we're going to have to... I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm going to re-roll that. All right, guys, so we're back, and I don't know if this actually lost recording or something. If it did, then that sucks. If not, then, hey, I want to go ahead and use that in the beginning. But essentially, I died pretty hardcore... Uh, with Sajin because he paralyzed me, then he just killed me. Hopefully Shiro can just take the freaking front of his super attack. Or his special. Can you just go, Sajin? Come on! Sajin, use your goddamn special. That's all I wanted. So now I can go over and kill you. And I feel bad that I just sacrificed my Toshiro, my buddy, my friend Toshiro, but... You know, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> uh, now we're going up against Toshiro. He's really freaking powerful. He's a pain in the butt powerful, actually. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and hope that I don't freaking get too much. Oh, cool. Ooh, get away, get away, get away, get away. Ooh, awesome. I got away. Awesome. Hell yeah. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. All right, cool. Wow, we actually got really lucky here. Um, we're gonna go ahead with Arnaro because Arnaro is at full stamina. He should either be able to one-shot Renji or at least get him down low enough where it won't matter. Boom. Look at this freaking... Oh, such a freaking disgusting and bad, awesome... Super special attack. <laughs> I call it super attack because the Dokkan battle. Wow, that's it? That's all the damage he freaking did? What what freaking garbage is that? And he can't even get to halfway. Oh, man. I'm lucky that my freaking Sajin had such good DR damage reduction on him. Man, what freaking garbage. That, that's such a horrible unit. I really thought that Aranaro was a good, like, freaking debilitator for the freaking bosses. I have full damage output on the guy, and he still, he, I have literally two just high shentai on him, uh, and I have uh, spiritual pressure increase for the you know, little, whatever that thing is, a little droplets of water, or of whatever that is, uh, and I have uh, all damage output at 100%, how the heck did he not one-shot him, or at least get close enough to? Oh man, alright, so um, I have to go in this and select my heart team, and then I just gotta go and uh, essentially put the characters on them. Uh, the yeah, the character link. So I'll be right back while I do that. All right. So I went, I got ahead, and I did that. I got all my characters set up. I think that my Ayanaro did not get the full damage output on it because I don't think that I set him up with all the uh, full stamina damage. I, I don't know 100%, but um, that could have been why he didn't do that well. Uh, we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna select the friend Gene over here just because he does do Soul Reaper damage. We'll look at that. Okay. So spiritual pressure 20, spiritual pressure 30, stamina 40. Um, okay, cool. He should be able to help me out at least with the first round. Now, the reason why I have Toshiro at the end is because I pulled uh, five dupes of him. So I have his super attack. I guess you could call it super attack. I think that's what it's called in this game. Uh, up to five, so he's fully maxed out. And I believe that's a 50% increase. I think it's 10% increase per uh, level. So he should be doing a lot of damage. I threw all the output on him, and he has the most spiritual pressure. Gin does poison, and Yorichi is one of the best NAD da uh, damagers on the heart team and i don't think anyone on heart actually has flurry yet who knows maybe if the new kimpachi comes out he will be a heart flurry character 
kind of hoping he will be. Because I don't even, I think the only two uh, heart Kenpachis, uh, or in, actually, uh, we don't have a mind Kenpachi, we have a mind flurry. Uh, but there is a mind or a heart Kenpachi, and that is the White Day Kenpachi. And then they also have the five star silver character from the raids. Uh, he's also a heart. So I'm kind of hoping that at some point, though, they do give us another flurry uh, heart character. That would freaking be awesome and tie off the last attribute. Um, Yodorichi is cool and everything, but she definitely doesn't have the type of damage output. She's a freaking fun character, though. I always love playing with Yodorichi because she's just so freaking fat. Look at that. She's just across the map. Like, Momo, you, you got nothing on me, Momo. <laughs> That's it. Like, I can just go here. Boom. All right, cool. On the other side of the map, I got more health. And then Yodorichi, without even any time, freaking 20 seconds, she's over here. Oh, yes, Yodorichi versus Soyphone. I love that. <laughs> uh, that's awesome. Boom. Okay. Wow. Yodorichi almost got killed over here. Boom, boom. No. I was kind of hoping that, uh... Ooh, thank God. All right, cool. So, yeah, it's kind of hard to actually play this game. It is nothing like, uh playing Dokkan Battle when I'm on the, like, when I'm talking to you guys through the microphone, I actually have to pay attention because you could freaking die so easily. Alright, so damage inflicted, 48% output. Toshiro, go for it, kill him, destroy. <laughs> dragon, dragon output over here. Wow, look at that, it's so freaking badass. Yep, that's what I'm talking about right there. He stood no chance, he is an awesome boss killer. He's, he was actually the, the first card... Um, I believe he's my first card that I got up to level 200. He was one of the first ones that I worked on. There we go. And that, with that, guys, that is the last level of Boss Rush completed. Uh, we are all set. We're going to go ahead and um, going to go collect the rewards. And then we'll go ahead and re-roll an item. So you know what item I'm going to re-roll? I'm going to re-roll an item that... Oh, actually, let's go collect it first for the orders. Um, I think I'm going to do a heart item. We'll see. Let me go take a look and see what's, what, we, what we actually want to do. Perfect. We got everything done. Awesome. So we got my dailies. Dailies complete. Weeklies, I'm almost done. Alright, awesome. So, I got that. Do I have any gifts? What, what is it? This gives 14 gifts. Two friend points. That's what it is. Alright, so we're taking them. Friend points collected. Let's go ahead and take a look at my accessories real quick. I don't know which one I want to do. I, I'm essentially trying to get it set up with where my PvP uh, accessories to get them in a really good spot. Uh, so, let's see. What is it? So, I have this guy. Attack plus 20% for Saj, and we're going to keep him. Stamina is good. Stamina, yeah, that's it, because that's all I need. And attack, yeah, attack plus 30. So, my Sajin's all set. I'm not messing with Sajin. Um, the other one who I have is, I have Red Barry, I have Blue Kenny, because obviously Blue Kenny, but Blue Kenny is actually all set. So I have Red Barry, right? And I also have Tsukishima. Now, I want to run Tsukishima over Red Barry, because he does have that feeling option. Uh, the problem is I don't have enough DR, but I kind of want to get, get him set for DR. Now, I would run Tsukishima with this chappy. He doesn't have attack plus 30. I'm definitely going to keep that. I don't want to reroll that. I have an Enraku ready for him. I believe that's how you say the name, Enraku or Enreku, whatever it is. But he is that plus 40%. So, at this time, it would really just be the Tai Shentai. And it's Spiritual Pressure plus 3, which increases the 6%, which is kind of all right i guess you would want it to be more if it's spiritual pressure based um i would prefer to have uh, some type of damage output or you know stamina output uh but outside of that i mean i don't really need anything else i don't have any pupples for this unfortunately which really stinks um stamina plus 12 percent on the hojikuzi or hojikazai <laughs> i'm sorry i watch bleach cowboy a lot so if any of you actually want real good information about about bleach brave souls go check out bleach cowboy he's one of my favorite bleach uh, youtubers that i watch so i always so i always go and check him out for any type of information um when it comes to the yukis i really have nothing good for the yukis um over here stamina stamina i, I get a lot of freaking stamina with my freaking pulls or my re-rolls and stuff so but you know what we're going to do? We're going to go ahead with the Tai Shentai, and we're just going to do the reroll second effect. I only have the one editing brush, so here is to some luck. Tai Shentai, give me something good. Either attack, attack, or stamina, or spiritual pressure. Let's see. We're going to wait till it slows down, and we're probably going to go for... No! No, no, no! Oh, what garbage. That's the worst stat in the game. I saw all stats plus 10% and I got excited. So I tried to go for that. 
God damn it, we're not gonna use that was such a waste of a reroll. <laughs> I hate you so much. Oh, gosh. Anyway, that's it, guys. Thank you for joining me here today. Uh, make sure to subscribe if you're new. I don't do a lot of Bleach Brave Souls, but I'm going to start doing some at least gameplay. I won't be bringing any of that kind of news to the channel, but I'll throw it up every once in a while. The same thing with Naruto Blazing Battle, though that account is way freaking noob, so I don't even know if I'll be doing that for you guys. But uh, Dokkan Battle all the time. This is Bleach Brave Souls. If you have any uh, requests in Bleach, let me go ahead. Let me know down in the comments below, and I'll start putting up some different videos of whatever. Anyway guys, thank you for joining me today, subscribe if you're new, and I'll catch you all later.